six interfaces of control panel. Work interface. Adjust interface. Speed interface. Tools interface. Configuration interface. Test interface. Common functions of the work interface. Return to the original zero position. Display origin successful. Viewing the real-time coordinates of each axis. Movement, rotation, lifting. W-axis rotation. X, Y-axis movement. Set the amplitude of movement or rotation. See axis lifting. A axis lifting. Switching the speed of movement. Manual activation of absorption. Control area for processing. Set cutting start point. View cutting range. Return to the cutting start position. Cancel processing. Start and pause processing. Move X. Y axis to the extreme position of the machine. Common functions of the adjustment interface. Setting the cutting depth of the tool. Switch different tools. Set the amplitude of tool drop. Falling or lifting tools. Test the set cutting depths. Lowering the tool to the lowest position. Saving or cancelling two depth data. The height of the tool raised during the cutting process. Real-time adjustment of cutting depths. Manually turning on tool oscillation. Setting the processing speed. Setting the speed based on the tool. Different cutting tools. The speed of straight lines, accelerations, curves and small circles. Can save three speed parameters, fast, medium, and slow. Quickly switch different cutting parameters. Speed of tool lifting and falling.
other speed parameters. Time required to start the tool. The required time for starting the vacuum pump. The required time for the vacuum pump to shut down. Setting the level of cutting accuracy. Angle of tool lifting. Compensation data for feeding. Feeding lengths. Diameter using small circle cutting speed. Feeding speed. Switch the mode of cutting speed to operation number. Set processing according to operation number. Switching operation number. Set cutting speed parameters. The speed and compensation data of tool falling and lifting. Switching between manual or automatic modes. Automatic or manual activation of absorption. Automatic adaptation to the workbench. Is the security system activated? Set different zero point modes. Set blade compensation data for lifting and falling. Set up several layers of cutting and the depth of each cutting. Set the parameters of the v grooving tool. Set cutting depth data. Set compensation data for groove width. Set the processing speed of the V-grooving tool. Common commands for testing interface. Testing the height of the workbench. Read the last processed pattern. Set tools corresponding to different operation numbers. The position where the tool stops after processing is completed. Switching between different partition absorption modes. View the area of the partition. 